the most part, we are going to out-rifle teams. We're going to out-springfield them and out-long-range game them. And it'll really help the short-range guys get into place. We should get in the train station and force them to wings and see what we can't do with that. Then we should push in on wings. Pinch in, suppress, suppress, kill, 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 kill. We're alive. And he's back in there. Go out there and get the flag. Because that flag here has to go about 20 yards. And he's gone. Well, it must be close to the Armageddon, Lord. No, then I won't fly by that last and new topic. To pull out my west and you brought me. And I'm stressing and talking. Get him about me, cause I always want to go storm and been bombing. And you're better, my ghetto. I won't settle, get on my level. I probably be punished for hard living. Blind to the facts, thugs is convicts and guards prison. Hands on the strap, praying so father, please forgive me. Police be rushing when they see me, I flaunt it. America's most wanted, live on TV like pleasure and pain. Stuck in this game, hollering my name. We all gon' die, we bleed through similar veins. Please explain to me now, don't panic when my guns burst. You heard the last jam, nigga. This one's worse. My nigga bone held the chrome till I came home. Thug love player, tell these bitch niggas bring it on. I caught a plane out to Cleveland late last evening to help my niggas clean up some niggas no longer breathing. Now, who do you believe in? Hit the weed and breathe. It's a cold ass world, niggas. Kill you in your sleep. Watch me until they stop me. Bury, murder me, or drop me. I got thug love for my nation while I pass it. Feel me?
going. He's going. He's out of there. What's going on? Oh, he's shut down by Borg from the house that you were talking about over on the Allied side. Borg. Because they played defensive. A six-man D. What a joke. If this keeps up, 
this legal joke. Eventually it did when we played season two. A guy named Sil liked to act all cool. He banned half our team because we were too bad. I called him corrupting after one year back. One year later, fresh off my suspension, there's a new game that I forgot to mention. It's Call of Duty 2. Oh, how cool. I think I'll get my team and we can raise this too. We joined up on Cal, just rolling noobs. We won the championship, now what you gonna do? It's time to retire, this game is way too easy. We'll see you suckers later. But she, Bokai, show me love up in the club. Kirito, show me love up Yo, show us love. Yo, Kirito, your motherfucker show me some love. Where you at, Victor? Quiz and Poker Jones up in the house. Y'all better sit down when we come into that server. You better get on your knees and get ready to suck some dick. Cause we gonna come rape your face. Come on, run over my grenade, bitch! Fuck you! What a terrible player. You're bad. The game's so broken. Fuck! Come on, some cover! The other way. From grenade! It's so dumb. And it wasn't because I was being stupid either. I went a different route six times in a row and died from six different grenades. I have what people call preferred vision. You see, whenever I open the cow forms in any section, any thread is named by me, and when I open it, every single post just has my name in it. I'm the only thing people talk about, I'm the only thing that matters. It's just my name plastered everywhere over the entire website. Then I could spray 25 clips into your head and then some random noob 101 Army Infantry Division fag will shoot one bullet across the entire map and BOOM! HEADSHOT! By the way, I just finished supper because my uh, legion of chefs just served me a 20 course meal that fit on like 25 10,000 foot tables and it was enough to cure world hunger and I just ate a couple bites. I nibbled a little bit of a chicken leg, and then a poor person came to my door and rang it and asked me if his family could eat out of my dumpster and all the food that I threw out, and I said no, and I ordered my bodyguards to set the dumpster on fire so they could never eat anything ever. I just know it exists because I received a memo on my desk from one of my important secretaries. Get a life. Your friend lives in a gas station pump? What a terrible player.